Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues. I'm Mr. Zaman and today I'll talk about novel insights into protein-mediated motor neuron loss in amyotropic lateral sclerosis. In patients with ALS or amyotropic lateral sclerosis, the motor dysfunction symptoms usually appear in one part of the body such as the limbs and then progress to others. This further suggests that degeneration starts in one type of motor neuron and thereafter propagates to the other motor-related neurons. Previous studies have highlighted the accumulation of TDP43 in motor neurons as a co-occurrence with ALS. The researchers developed ALS mouse models that primarily accumulate TDP43 in the cortical motor neurons, spinal motor neurons or skeletal muscles. They then examined how the TDP43 in specific motor neurons initiates disease progression to other motor related neurons. The researchers found that TDP43 induced in the cortical neurons of the mouse ALS models caused mild degeneration. They further found that TDP43 was transported along the axons and transferred to the oligodendrocytes non-neuronal cells that support neurons by enwrapping axons with a protective layer called myelin to facilitate neuronal signal transmission. In contrast, TDP43 induced in the spinal motor neurons did not spread to other cortical or spinal neurons but broadly induced cell death in the motor neurons and other neighboring neurons in the spinal cord. In addition, it led to severe atrophy of the muscles which further led to motor dysfunction. Their data revealed that TDP43 spreads across neuroglial connections in the motor pathway and causes different pathological events to degenerate the spinal cord, suggesting that TDP43 has distinct mechanisms for degeneration in the motor circuits of ALS. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.